Many of Florida's teachers are asking Governor DeSantis to prioritize school employees in getting the vaccine. News 4 Jacks reporter Zach Lashway spoke to the head of the largest teachers union about the spread of COVID-19. Across the nation and here at home, students and teachers are having to isolate and quarantine because of COVID-19. Our public schools are not the super spreaders we thought they were going to be. That is good news. However, as community spread goes up, cases in our public schools go up. Educators have been on the front lines making sure that our public schools continue to operate, making sure that our kids are getting the education they deserve. Andrew Spar, president of Florida Education Association, says it is paramount for Florida to stay ahead of the spread of coronavirus in our schools and is urging Governor Ron DeSantis to prioritize teachers in the plan for vaccinations in Florida. This is not calling for mandatory vaccinations. It's just trying to speed up the process in which our educators who want to be vaccinated uh, are able to receive those vaccinations. DCPS's dashboard shows nearly 700 cases of COVID-19 district-wide, 218 cases among staff members, 473 cases among students. The last week and a half, we know of at least five educators who have died from COVID in the state of Florida, uh, from a principal uh, to teachers to support staff and bus drivers. And so that is a great concern and we have to protect our educators. The Pfizer vaccine is for people 16 and older. That is including some juniors and seniors. Any talk of students receiving the vaccine? We do know in our high schools, uh, clearly there's been more spread than there has been in some of our uh, younger grades. So absolutely. Ensuring our future is not only bright, but healthy. In Jacksonville, Zach Lajway, Channel 4, The Local Station.